Part 3, Door Panel Placeholder Let's start Go to Interior Elevation Let's change the scale to 1 is to 10 Graphic Display Let's select the Hidden Line Select Reference Plane Create a Reference Plane Dimension, select this reference plane and this reference plane. Pick, select the dimension. Let's create a new parameter and name this seal height. Okay, make it instance. Okay, <coughs> go to reference level go to family types select the seal height let's move this down and change the value to 10 millimeter let's create a new parameter make it instance and name this actual height okay this is the actual height for the door panel let's make a formula height minus seal height okay apply okay <coughs> Next, go to create, select reference line, pick at the hinge point or on this corner, pick and pick here. Next, align the reference line, select the reference plane and tab and select the blue dot pick and lock select the interior reference plane tab tab pick the blue dot and lock okay select the reference line pick the make this temporary dimension permanent permanent pick okay select the dimension and select the width okay next go to annotate select the angular dimension pick at interior reference plane and pick the reference line okay pick select the dimension create new parameter and name this opening angle okay make it instance okay next go to family types let's try the parameters opening angle let's move this down <coughs> let's change the angle to 10 okay let's make it zero good let's try 20 okay the width let's change this to 900 okay okay <coughs> okay let's move the opening angle okay now let's make the door panel placeholder select the extrusion pick a plane set this plane from reference line pick then pick lines pick this reference line okay lock go to offset uh, 100 pick this line okay offset 
let's say 50 pick okay pick uh, let's pick the other one okay next select the line offset make it zero okay close the line okay lock pick here and here lock make line at the midpoint pick and pick <coughs> next trim uh, trim this line pick here and here uh, pick here and here pick this one uh, this one okay next make a dimension make it equal dimension select these two lines select the dimension and select the door thickness 45 millimeter okay next dimension pick this line and this okay, pick again dimension pick this line the center line okay and this line make it equal <coughs> next uh, finish the extrusion okay go to interior elevation now go to extru extrusion start select the seal height okay extrusion and select the height okay next uh, reference level uh, let's check the parameters let's say this 1000 millimeter okay good uh, opening angle zero okay so 45 okay next uh, let's try to change the height to 2000 millimeter let's see the interior elevation okay let's go back to reference level okay let's go back to 2100 apply okay next let's save the family okay next let's load the door panel i have a door panel here okay let's open this ts3100 Okay, so I have this already. So let's try to load this into our project, into our family. Okay, so select the place on work plane, pick, next align, pick the center line and the center line of the door panel okay then lock next select the door panel and let's map all the parameters from the family panel height let's select the actual height <coughs> for the elevation select the seal height For the panel thickness, select the door thickness, thickness, okay, and the panel width, select the width, 
so all the parameter is mapped now let's align the door panel to the center line of the door placeholder okay lock next select the door panel placeholder select okay select again then go to graphics uncheck visible okay graphics uncheck the visible so it will not show up in our project uh, let's see the interior shaded okay good next Reference level one. Okay, let's open the our project. Uh, let's go to desktop. Let's open the door project. Open. Go back to the family, save, <coughs> and load the project and close. Insert the door family okay select the door let's play with the parameters and check door casing and the door jam okay so yeah okay it's door family okay select again Let's go to edit type. Let's change the width to 800 if it works. Okay, good. Okay. Let's go back to 900. Apply, okay. Now let's change, let's play with the angle opening angle let's make it 10 degrees 0 and 90 perfect let's look at the 3d okay see you on part 4 thank you